My earliest gymnastics memory is probably when I went to a birthday party in a gym and I just couldn't get off the trampolines. My parents wanted me to go into dance, but uh, that was not for me. I had too much energy for that. So they stuck me in a gym and instantly I fell in love with the sport. I feel like I've always known that I've wanted to do college gymnastics. I knew that the Olympics weren't so much my, um, my destiny and I've always been into like the whole show of it and watching college gymnastics is honestly inspiring and amazing way to continue doing the sport that I love. When I first came here, you know, you just get a feeling that it's like home. Um, the girls here were incredible. The coaches, especially Larissa, um, she was just really genuine and motherly, and I love that about her. She's that athlete that you want in, in the worst of times. Like if you have a fall and you're gonna have to count, that's the kid that you want going because she lets you know with everything she is, don't worry, it's not a problem, I got it. I'm not sure if you would have asked her in her freshman year if she ever believed that she would compete as one of the best in the Big Ten, um, I think she would probably laugh because she, that's what she's best at and say, oh yeah, sure, um, but not really believe that. I think now she knows that she can keep up with the best. I want her to be able to leave her mark on the program the way she wants it left. Probably the biggest accomplishment that I could say for myself as a coach is when a, um, your student athlete comes full circle relying a lot on obviously the coaching staff. My teammates helped me, push me a lot. I still got stuff to prove and I think that motivates me to better myself in the gym every day. I really want to have fun. It's my last year doing gymnastics ever so I think like enjoying myself out there not stressing too much and really like pushing the underclassmen to kind of bring this program to another level.